right, hey, shalom, shalom to the elect. All right, first and foremost, before I begin this lesson, I want to give all praises, honor, and infinite glory to Yahweh. Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai, Baha Shem, Akakogash, with the water, Yahweh Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai, for giving us the spirit of truth in these last days, which we cannot receive. Giving double honors to the apostles, all right, and elders, great millstone. Taught us his truth and do who well. Right? And do who will well. Peace, love, and salutations to the corner. Well, Akim, the elders, and the brothers stand stiffly for the means of Yahweh, Barshim, Yahusha, and truth. And sincerity. Alright, and, um, you know, pretty much, I just want to do a quick, you know, uh, you know, just bringing out this information. You know, just going, to, going through a few news uh, articles, man. All right, now as you can see from the end time headlines, all right, dot org. Okay, you got this um, festivity take taking place. I guess they started doing this shit every year now, or whatever. But I just want to say, you know, um, you know, ultimately the scriptures are just coming to life, you know, and, and this just gives more uh, justification to why the heavenly Father goes on to be God the Son. Okay, it's going to uh, destroy Babylon the Great. All right. Okay, um, so I got a few clips, but before I actually play these clips, I'm gonna go ahead and um, just read a few of this, um, you know, um, this article here, man, and bring out a few scriptures and right to the point. All right, so as you can see, it says, uh, modern Sodom and Gomorrah, burning man, which that's spiritual in itself. Right? Because the scriptures say, they cometh that shall burn as an oven. And all the proud and they that do wickedly shall be stubble. So, you know, <laughs> these people are literally, the Lord just made these these people for extras, man, to fulfill biblical prophecy. Alright? That's why they they have it, you know, they have this, they have it on this side, man. Especially when it comes down to all right, things of the world. All right. Festival hosts virgin sacrifice parties. All right. Are you up? All right, Con. That'd be great. Con. That's right, brother. That's right, man. All right, it says a warning. Content may be offensive to some. What looks like modern sovereign war. Thousands of thrill seekers have flocked to Nevada. Uh, it's like it. Thousands of thrill seekers have flocked to Nevada's Black Rock Desert to get stuck into what many are calling the wildest festival of the year. All right, say uh, the nine-day extravaganza kicked off on Sunday. August 25th, right, with fe uh, festival goers known as burners setting up their theme camps across the sun, big player. All right, so <laughs> the festival goers, okay, are known as burners, man. And that's spiritual in itself because they definitely finna be on fire. <laughs> All right, and that's why I'm gonna play this clip. Okay, it says with only uh, port provided, these interpared adventurers must pack whatever they need to tough it out in the extreme conditions. It says while they embrace the Vince good old spirit of its self-reliance, they are never wrong. More than 1,000 do-it-yourself camps, camps unite each year to rustle up a bonkers banquet or a banquet of activities that really make Burning Man tick. All right? So, you know, meanwhile, the Lord, Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shai, got, you know, um, the gathering of these nations coming together via the Third World War and the ushering in of this um, RFID and OTB technology. All right? On the left hand of uh, the elites. Ultimately, uh, 
are headed by the spiritual demon Satan. Okay? You got these people out here that are, you know, hey man, just caught up in all type of shit in the world, man. Folly, all right, uh, uh, um, idolatry, all right, ultimately that's because they, that's all that was taking place was rituals, what you're going to see in this uh, clip, and the worshiping of idols, and just people just lost, man. All right, um, it says, and for the ladies, there are such sleep body washes and happy ending massages on tap daily as the day heats up. Hit the naughty naked village for a daily dose of discipline at the hands of the fist, quote, Domina Priestess, who's ready to deliver a proper spanking. All right, there's the infamous orgy uh, dorm at Burning Man, and we know that these are all things that were taking place. And, um, ancient Sodom and Gomorrah. This is why that place got destroyed. So why would you mock? Why would you mimic? Have a festival with these things? Why? Because it's all prophecy, man. Alright? It says, uh, the infamous orgy dome at Burning Man is hosting regular consent chats and providing a space for couples and morsums, whatever the hell that is, to get their groove on, right? Virgin sacrifice ceremonies every 30 minutes. Revenge of the horny alien scientists. All right. Wow. And the festival provides its exclusivity, inclusivity, inclusivity. Slot if I'm saying that uh, wrong. Inclusivity, right? By also hosting best sex of your life, living with H and STIs which doesn't go into detail what it actually entails last year's festival, including, you see the word, sea fighting, all right? While beloved naked oil wrestling bouts provided a slippery showdown. So this is all type of manner of wickedness that's taking place, all right, at these uh, events, man. So you look this, this crap up, this satanic event, all right? Was, you know, this is what's taking place. All right, they call it art and creativity, but it's nothing but rituals. All right, all right, and uh, deception, man. Rituals, all right, and the worshiping of Satan, okay? So I'm gonna play this one here first. Sufficiency. Oh, no, 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 it's not here. I'm gonna play this one here first. See this coming here, end time is playing before our very own eyes. That's right, right? This is all just, you know. But these things have to play out so that way the Lord can be justified in overthrowing this place as he did uh, Solomon Gomorrah, man. So that the prophecy can be fulfilled. Without real spirit, you know. All right, people are just lost in a sauce, man. Okay, and leading them slap. All right, to a missile. This is a, what you call missile behavior. <laughs> all right, second death behavior. You know, however you want to put it, but behaving yourself like this in its conduct and its uh, manner of life. All right, it's going. It's going to lead you to nothing but uh, destruction, man. The Lord Yahweh Bashem El Shah.
see them spirits start really hopping on these people at, you know, at the night hours, man. All right? All, all type of filth, you know. <laughs> you know, and, uh, true satanic events take place at, at the nighttime, man. Festival that transforms a desolate stretch of the Nevada desert. All right, but you know, let me just get a you know quick, quick scripture real quick. All right, this is Isaiah 13 verse 19. In Babylon, the glory of kingdoms, the beauty of the Chaldeans' excellency. All right, this is speaking about. This is all coded for America. All right. Okay, so. Isaiah 13 and verse 19. You going up there? You going up there? Isaiah 13, 13 and verse 19. In Babylon, the glory of kingdoms. In Babylon, the glory of kingdoms, the beauty of the Chaldees, excellency, shall be as when the Most High overthrew Sodom and Gomorrah. Yeah, kind of so. And that's what's coming, man. The Lord ultimately is getting ready to destroy. All right, Babylon the Great. Okay, just as he did. All right, so let me go more, man. So this is this is beautiful that these things are actually taking place and coming to pass. All right, and um, we we <clears throat> actually living in the times to where okay, uh, they're being played out, man. All right, so call Halal your how about you shy for pulling us out of the world. Okay, of festivities pulling us out of the world. Okay, of vanity. Okay? Because all this behavior, all this doing is, 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 is leading you to a destruction. We're in a whole different spirit, man. You know, brothers don't be in all this, this, this shit, man. But you know, you got Jake. I seen a lot of Jake out there too. In a few of the clips. But this is what our people are into, man. You see the, you see the eye right there. All right. So, you know what I said? This is all just, <laughs> it's a big ass concert, man. Out, out in the desert. So, you know, this, this you know, and the Lord knows, as you see in that article, what the hell these people are getting themselves in, more sense. All right. Uh, sea fighting. All right, naked wrestling. Come on, man. So, like I say this is the spirit. People just go on, bro. Lost through. All right. Verse twenty: It shall never be inhabited. Neither shall it be dwelt in from generation to generation. Neither shall the Arabian pitch their tent there. Neither shall the shepherds make their fold there. Yeah, so this place is not going to be inhabited again. This place has did nothing but destroy the so-called Negro, Latino, Native American, Indian man. Separated him from his uh, woman and children. All right, and caused nothing but chaos and confusion rapidly across the four, four corners of the earth. Okay, so it's, it's, it's not going to be, nobody's going to be able to dwell here anymore from generation to generation. All right. And there's not going to be any any pitching of the, of the tents, man. Setting up shop. All right. 
So these things have to play out. Second Peter 2 and verse 6. And turn the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah into ashes. Condemn them with an overthrow, making them an example unto those that after should live ungodly. Alright? So that's exactly what's getting ready to happen to this place. So it's no coincidence. It's called Burning Man. Alright? And according to this article, what they're actually doing out there. When it, you know, when it really goes down, the infamous orgy dome at Burning Man. Virgin sacrifices, ceremonies. Alright? Um, the best sex of your life, living in you know, living with H STIs, C fighting, grown grown as men, naked wrestling. Alright? Okay. <laughs> okay. So, hey man, we got, you know, we got to bring these things out as, you know, crazy and weird as it, it might seem to you, but, you know, this is why Sodom and Gomorrah got destroyed. All right? And that example is, is, is for this place, man, because these are ungodly people. People don't uphold the laws, that's the members of Yahweh, so shout to the best of their ability. They don't know, Lord. Man, look at Jake out there going through. Alright. All black, complete demons, bro. That's why it's just best to be by yourself, bro. You no. Know, younger brothers like myself, bro. It's just real. It ain't nothing out here for you, bro. A whole bunch of bug outs. So I just find that, you know, interesting, something to bring out. All right, and how just, it's all spiritual. Burning Man 2024. <laughs> what, what, what did it say? Uh, the, the festival that changed my life. Yeah, it, you're damn right. It, it, changed, it changed your life for the, for the worse. Because now you miss a fool. Verse 7, and deliver it just lie. Vex with the filthy conversation of the wicked. All right, so we vex with, this, with the filthy conversation, bro. In the NLT, but the Most High also rescued Lot out of Sodom because he was a righteous man who was sick of the shameful immorality of the wicked people around him. And that's us, bro. We, bro, this, this place makes you literally sick. All right? Because what? Let's get that scripture that says, um, Isaiah 59 and 15, yea, true failing. That's why, man, the truth. And it's not that it, it, it's, it mean it's like, yeah, the, oh, man, uh, you know, the truth, is, it actually is not prospering. No, it mean it like that this is a place where truth is not upheld, man. It's not upheld. It's not, yeah, how about some shots, laws, that's commandments, and the right way of living is not put on a pedestal. The scriptures say, warn to him that buys evil for good and good for evil. And surely the turning of, of things upside down. So what's right and esteem right in the eyes of the Lord is actually evil in, in, in this present world, this present time. But this is all for the justification of the Heavenly Father's righteous indignation. All right. So this is beautiful, man. Yea, true faileth, and he that departed from evil maketh himself a prey. So we made ourselves a uh, prey being these, these spirits out here, man constantly trying to draw you back to once things that you were a part of and that's why it's beautiful to stay around uh, brothers and you know, get, gain as much as you can because ultimately stay locked in the spirit because there's coming a time where the Lord God bless some is getting ready to visit this place on a high level a high spiritual uh, 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 level and it's going to be uh, certain adjustments that you can't be emotional about just know that what it, 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 <laughs> This judgment was sent from the heavens, man. It's time, all right? And that's the time that we're coming into. And the Lord saw it and it displeased him that there was no judgment. All right, but that's the point, man. So we departed from this place. So I'm gonna close out on verse uh, seven again in the NLT. Second Tim, uh, I'm sorry, Second Peter chapter two, verse seven. But the Most High also rescued Lot out of Sodom because he was a righteous man who was sick of the shameful immorality of the wicked people around him. So. 
We're looking to be rescued out of this spiritual uh, Sodom in Egypt, man. As it says in Revelation. All right, um, the, the 11th chapter. The dead body shall lie in the streets, the streets which is spiritually called Sodom in Egypt. Okay, so, um, and this is where the Lord Yahweh Shai is spiritually crucified. He's X'd out. Truth faileth here, man. It's not upheld. It's not considered uh, uh, the, right, the right way of living. Now, nah, do as thou wilt and be a, a nigga and a, and a whore, a slut, slut walk. All right? And idolatry is an adultery. And the hatred of, of your brother, killing your brother, slaying your brother, man. Rather than being a brother's keeper and, 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 and you know, loving thy neighbor as thyself. Look, these things is not upheld here, man. So when this judgment do come, the Lord is going to deliver the elect who are sick of the shameful immorality of the, people, of the wicked people around him, man. And people have low morals, low vibration, low frequency. All right, nothing about them wants uh, unrighteousness. And that their immorality is reaching the heavens. All right, so, you know, I just want to bring that out, man. A little bit of the fun to the elect. Till next time, I say shalom.